Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to more Tetris 99. So, I haven't noticed what. So, um, I was basically looking up all sorts of stuff in terms of like mechanics and stuff like that and uh, I was like, oh yeah, this actually isn't quite like the Tetris multiplayer that I knew. See, what you're actually supposed to be doing is getting badges through knockouts, which increases your attack power. That's what that whole percentage and up thing is at the bottom right corner of your playfield. So if you get four full-on badges, you'll be able to get that up to 100% and greatly increase your attack power. And that's kind of what was my issue in the later game, was because I wasn't playing aggressively enough for that sort of thing. And I was like, like I was playing mostly survival, I guess you could say, just to see how far I could get into it, figuring that they would, I don't know, KO themselves? No, not, not really. <laughs> That's, that's highly unlikely with skilled Tetris players. What I mean is that um, I, I was just basically playing my own game and it was not quite what I need <laughs> to actually get stuff going. So what I'm going to do here is kind of kind of start going for the combos and stuff like that, like multiple Tetrises in a row or something like that, maybe, perhaps, might be. So I, yeah, it's... So that's another sort of mechanic, is that if you get multiple uh, destructive things in a row, you can actually increase the power of said destructive things, as I expected. So, yeah, that's uh, definitely something to focus on, even if you're doing singles. Uh, that's, that's not a bad spot for it to appear in, actually. I just, uh, ooh, actually, I'm gonna go flip-flop that around. Uh, I don't want to create a hole. I mean, I, I could probably figure out some sort of T-spin if I was a pro, but I don't know, T-spins just aren't in my vocabulary of reflex just yet. <laughs> yeah, it's okay, though. I'm pretty sure I can get by relatively without, hopefully. <laughs> I, keep, I know I keep... Oh, I knocked, oh shoot, missed drop. I was going to say I, I'm not getting close to uh, uh, playing decent until I got the missed drop. And then alas, alas, here we are. Nah, I'm okay. It's not that bad. Just kind of get myself through this as quickly as I can. Actually, I'm going to do it like that. Just to kind of... Yeah, that'll actually do. Because then I can do that. Flop that around. Put that in place. And yes, I should be, once again, concentrating to the best of my ability. And not talking, but... Eh, we'll see how much of an impact it actually makes. I don't know. I know I'm getting attacked by a whole bunch of stuff here, but I'm hoping that it's all gonna appear in that center column. Yes! <laughs> see, it's not that big of a deal if you get stuff on your side, just as long as you uh, know where it's coming from, basically. And, well, sometimes it switches, but other times you can use that to your advantage. Yeah, getting a bunch of garbage isn't the end of the world, even though it's called garbage. <laughs> <laughs> it's just namely because of the whole, um, it, it, it just fills you up rather quickly, and it seems like it's pretty threatening. It seems like it's pretty scary, but it's not really that scary. And anyway, I noticed that the columns just change position there, which it seems to like happen every, every so often, like no matter what you do. I don't know if there's anything that you can do to prevent that, because, you know, it's, it's garbage. It's still meant to hinder you to some extent, but... I'm just trying to utilize the garbage to its maximum efficiency. And now you see my percentage is now at 50. Yeah, uh, when you get that badge up, it makes things so, so, so much easier to maintain when you're being attacked by a ton of people. And you know what, I'm going to go over to badges now to see if I can get some more badges out of this. Maybe, might be. Is now we're kind of like in the mid-game and I'm understanding this a bit more. And, you know, like, like the pro progress of what the poop is going on in the scoop. So we're just going to go ahead here and see what we can get out of it. I'm going to keep that middle column clean there. Because, well, uh, uh, I don't know, I guess. <laughs> okay, well, whatever. I can always just clear that out on top, which is a couple of more, couple pieces here and there. I'm going to go ahead and do that now, actually. Just kind of plop that there. Start filling in the gaps. Uh, I'll probably need at least 
four rows there anyway, so I might as well put that there. Okay. Let's see here. I don't want to get too much in trouble here, but I, I don't know. I'm getting some, some like weird pieces, and I'm not planning ahead enough. <laughs> uh, we'll see how it goes. You never know in Tetris. You can recover from the craziest of things. Like, look at that. <laughs> now we're sort of back on track. Uh, I'm gonna put that there. Yeah, I'm gonna get this all evened out here, if at all possible. Yes. Uh, you can give me a little bit, I suppose. I'm gonna actually do that. Yes, yes. Uh, it looked like I made a gap there, but it was pretty easy to get out of, obviously. <laughs> Uh, just, just all a part of the plan, for realsies and not joking. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go actually crisscross over like that. It'll make the gaps, but that, as long as I don't, yeah, see? As long as I don't overfill, like, above it, it'll clear out pretty nicely. And my badges are still about the same, unfortunately, so I'm not sure if I'll be able to make it to the top ones. <laughs> But yeah, that's basically how things go in Tetris 99. Is if, if you don't have the badges, it seems like you're hopelessly outclassed in the amount of damage that you can do. So that's why I'm trying to build them up as I go throughout the whole game, if at all possible. But it seems like when you get badges, it's not like something that you're doing on purpose. <laughs> It just kind of happens as you knock people out because there's so many people that it just yeah when you, when someone gets knocked out it just who who did it I don't know who did it just I guess whoever did the last attack on the person is the one who gets the kill because everyone is attacking everyone else I I think <laughs> anyway I should probably uh, now start going for the biggies again and now that I've gotten out of that predicament. Uh, so, well, that was, that was a triple, not a... well, well, uh, we're okay. <laughs> we're alright, I suppose. It's not that big of a deal. I'll stuff that in the corner. We keep this build going here all nicely. Pop that over in there. Counter that. I'm gonna actually... Whoa, 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 no, I wanna go... Yes, yeah, something that'll, like that. That'll do. <laughs> I was gonna say, it's gonna get a little bit fast for me to slide pieces around here like that. Luckily, I can t twist and turn them as need be. Uh, I'm actually get a whole bunch, aren't I? Oh, no! Well, I was gonna say I'm... Well, no, that's, that's not that bad, actually. Just hold on a sec, I'll show you what I mean. Just go like that. Go like that. Go down in there. <laughs> How does that sound? I think that sounds pretty good, at least to me. Wait, wait, wait a second, wait a second. Okay, I want to just probably knock that down a little bit. That's probably the best idea. I want to actually do that just so I can fit that in place a little bit later on. There we go. Plop that there. Swap that quickly. Over. Need more space. Also more badges, preferably. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. No, 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 no. Walk up, walk up, walk up. Wait, 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 wait. Well... That might be not be the end yet. Ooh, ooh. Oh, oh, no. <laughs> Fourth place. Yeah, as you see, I'm definitely... I'm Well, fifth place, I mean. I'm definitely getting the hang of it once I understood the whole badge thing. So it's just a matter of getting everything together in a single round, I guess. <laughs> and lasting until the final person. Maybe, hopefully. I also probably have to play all a bit more aggressively than I am. Like, well, I'm mainly focused on not on not misdropping and misplanning and stuff like that, so I'm a little bit on the slow side in regards to, I guess you could say, top players. But eh, I hold my own fairly decently, I would say. We'll see how things go, though, as because you never know in Tetris. They may misdrop themselves. I may overwhelm them then. Oh yeah, I gotta switch to KOs. <laughs> At least in the early game. Gotta stick with the strategy there, PK game. Mm, yeah, might as well just do a couple of build-ups there. There we go. Get that set up for the back-to-backs, if at all possible in the future. Whoa! <laughs> 
Actually, maybe I should have kept that going. I don't know. Mm. I just wanted that. I don't, I don't want to get to get too high, otherwise I'll start getting bombarded by all sorts of junk. <laughs> I'm gonna go switch to the left column. Actually, no, I'm gonna let them drop that garbage in my side. I think some of that at least. Mm, I don't know. If I'll, uh, I don't know. Maybe I should counter some of it. That that looks like a lot of garbage and. <laughs> That, that might uh, be a little too much for my field to handle. I'm gonna go like that. Pop that there. Swap to this. Then I can use this. And then finally counter with the eyepiece. And so it's a lot of quick thinking in here. And as I said, I probably need to be more aggressive than I am. I'm just trying not to make mistakes, if at all possible, although misdrops will probably still happen. Because, you know, it's Tetris, you're your own worst enemy for the most part, and how am I not getting any sort of badges for all those Tetrises that I did in the row? I don't know, and why am I being attacked by so many people? I don't know. <laughs> just look at all this stuff that I have to keep countering here. I'm not in that much trouble, am I? Cer certainly doesn't feel like it. <laughs> actually, I'm gonna go... No, wait. I should actually do... Yeah. Then this line is coming. And... Another line is a coming, too. Uh, wait, wait, oh, wait, wait, I did not press down or up. And I... And this is not like a regular D-pad, either. Uh, I think I would have been fine there if that wouldn't happen. <laughs> like, the D-pad of the uh, Nintendo Switch uh, Joy-Cons? It isn't really a D-pad, it's individual buttons. On, on both sides, regardless if you have the controls switched or not, so... <laughs> I don't know why that dropped so quickly, and I'm sure I didn't hit up or down. I don't know, I don't know. well, maybe I should have mashed the switch button, you know, like the flipping turny button, just so I could ensure that it didn't stick. I don't know, it just didn't seem like it was fast enough to actually stick, but it stuck, and it did me in. <laughs> Alright, let's go again. The KOs, please. Thank you, if at all possible. I don't know if that's really the best, per se, early game. I'm just taking a guess at it because of... The way things flow, I guess you can say. I figured it would go for the weakest players. I should no, not, I shouldn't say the weakest players. The people closest to the top, in theory. And then uh, what'll happen is that I could maybe get badges out of that. But that's not a guaranteed thing, obviously, it's because you're not really necessarily targeting people. Yes, you can target each. Like you can target individual players if you wanted to. But. It's still very, very finicky. <laughs> like in, like in that you don't really know how things are gonna turn out. Someone else might get the KO on someone else that you're targeting. So I'm not really super focused on individual players. I guess you could say. I just, I just kind of go for the most targets, so to speak. If that helps me potentially get a KO, because maybe it'll actually hit someone when they are in danger, maybe, could be, might be. <laughs> I don't know. Well, we're gonna see, I guess, as we go. I, I mean, it, I'm certainly getting results with this strategy, so it can't be that bad. Although, it is not first place just yet. <laughs> and... I would like to at least get one first place by the end of my trial here. I'm gonna actually go like that, yeah. Let's keep up the streak of Tetris's. Uh, bunk. Um, I need a blue, please, just so I can... Well, actually, this will be okay. So I can do that and that. Uh huh. Oh, actually, maybe I should have put that in the corner, but it's kind of too late now. I don't know, we're okay. I'm gonna actually go swap that into place. Look at me, not misdropping and planning ahead. What is this? This craziness. This is... This is impossible. <laughs> uh, I don't know, that's... Uh, I'm gonna go pick it up that away, I guess. Plop that in there. 
Mm-hmm. Something tells me that someone's gonna start mercilessly attacking me because I'm getting close to the top, even though I'm not in that much danger. Because I got all these... all the Tetrises in the world coming. <laughs> I notice that it's not that big of a deal if you get up near the top, just to, just as long as you don't let it actually hit you to the point that you'll actually uh, need to escape out of it very quickly, so to speak, too. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go something like that, I think. Yeah, I think I maybe got up too high and now people are, uh, yeah, <laughs> I was gonna say people are kind of kind of attacking now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that might have been my own fault, but I didn't get any badges whatsoever. Just... <laughs> That's another thing is that you're gonna be playing pretty well, and you're not gonna get badges off of it because other people are getting said KOs. It's like, well, how the poop do you actually manage to get consistent wins unless you're like this perfect player of massive speed that can absolutely outspeed everyone to everyone, every attack or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I've, I've even seen the super fast pros lose at it because of the, the seemingly random nature of the way attacks are handled in this game. I'm, well, I mean, I know it's not random, but, you know, you just gotta kinda attack and you've gotta hope that it's actually gonna do something. And that's not, uh, that's not really as skill-based, I guess you could say, <laughs> as you would expect out of Tetris. But, well, I guess that is the hand of Tetris that I've been dealt in this particular game style. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I, mean, I have not done any damage whatsoever because I've been just kind of building stuff up. I know I need to kind of carve out this top area here really quick. There we go. Mm-hmm. I'd like to... Actually, it's probably safe to do this. Because it's just going to be flat over at the level. Yeah. Ish. I mean, yeah, it's still coming up on that. Mm -hmm. eh, it's just me trying something different to build up things, I guess you could say. Before things get too hectic, but I think it's already gotten to the hectic point. But I don't know. I guess we're, no, we're, we're kind of back in back in line here with the potential winner circle. I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna go try and knock this down a little bit here. I need to get to those holes so I can get back to Tetrising, if you don't mind. And to do so, I've got to unleash. I should say release. These upper layers here. Hmm. Mm hmm. Like so. Yeah, it wasn't that bad or anything like that. It's just, you don't, you know, you can't panic. <laughs> Do not panic when you are under pressure whatsoever, or you might make a misdrop of your demise. And since I see stuff, uh, like I see the opening at the bottom right corner. I think I'm going to actually let some players outright attack me, and uh, perhaps maybe I can utilize that for some uh, attacks of my own, because I'll have uh, more resources to actually do that with, maybe? Uh, yeah, it looks like it's going to let me do so, so I guess I'll take that down a little bit, and I'll keep leaving that column open. And come on, make it go up high. Well, maybe not that high. <laughs> I was gonna say, just, just as long as I got a, a way to counter that, I probably should, because it might get a little, a little too close to the top, and then I'll get overwhelmed with uh, attackers. I'm gonna drop that there, start knocking down that side, because I see the the column has changed. <laughs> and I'm gonna swap that. Actually, I didn't even, didn't even need to do that. Because it was the whole... Uh, because both pieces didn't matter which order they were at, I could just place them anyway. It was kind of a, a waste of a switch for that turn, but it, at the end it didn't really matter, aside from a bit of wasted time. Anyway, I gotta get myself out of this very weird... Oh, I actually KO'd someone out of <laughs> luck, I guess. <laughs> uh, just, I just never know if that's, if that's something that I can really focus on or not just seems like when it happens, it happens. I'm just 
it's either I'm playing decently or I'm not, and I'm just recovering, and it just happens too. Because it's, however the piece setup is, I guess you could say at the time, for that person that I just so happened to be targeting with that. Maybe. Maybe it would be better off if I was targeting individual players in that sense, in a way, because you would have that control over the outcome of maybe their fate if they aren't under attack by many people in general and they're just up near the high, the, up near high the screen or something like that. Perhaps? I don't know. Maybe. Uh, all I know is I'm just gonna keep playing at the best that I can play and the current knowledge that I have. Uh, wait a second. Wait, I'm gonna go, actually. Yeah. Because I was like, I don't know about that square piece being placed right there and then. Go ahead and knock this down a smidge. There we go. I might, I can do that. And then I'll be able to get to this. For a delightful Tetris. And maybe it'll lead to victory. Oh, not if I do that. No, it's actually not a big deal or anything. I just wanted to build that up, but I got a little, a little too close to the edge. Just as long as I don't cover that opening or anything like that, we'll be okay. I'll just do a couple combos there to see if I can oh, actually put that there really quick. Because the rest of the stuff is uh, my main focus here to even out a little bit. And I'm just going to be able to do that a little bit easier if I have, if I have that line, there, line piece there anyway. Mm, okay. <clears throat> nice, nice. We are back in the driver's seat of not getting any badges. Well, I mean, yes, you do see I have a badge there, but it's not something that I can actually use to get uh, more attack power out of. You gotta get enough of, like, smaller badges, I guess you could call them, to get more badges. And, yeah, like that. Exactly like that. And now you see I'm at 50% because I got a whole bunch of stuff, which means that my attack power has increased. And I could also potentially knock out more people then. So it's like, sometimes I get far just because I, I just happen to KO more people some games than I do on other games, but I don't know if there's any way for me to actually, like, control that in the grand scheme of things. It just, because, I, like, there's too many, too many attacks going on to really uh, know if you're making a difference on your own game or not. Uh, that's, uh, it's looking good. I'm gonna actually go like that, and yep, I'm gonna go plop that. Oh, I was gonna, I was gonna say if I can flip that around with a spin, but that, that yeah, that, that doesn't work for a spin. Just, <laughs> I was, I was wrong about that sort of spin. That's okay though. We're not, we're so still in okay position here. We just gotta get back to ground level, I suppose. You can put, you can plop a little on there. I don't, I don't care that much. I'm just kind of. Uh, put that there. Just need to get myself preferably back into something decent. Wait, hold on. I'm gonna go plop those like that and the switch there so I can put that there and then swap for that. Because now the column is open, but I am under attack. <laughs> now maybe I can get a combo going here. Mm. No, I can't. I was more focused on the Tetrises and on the combos, but that's kind of what I'm aiming for <laughs> in general anyway, I guess. So I guess that's uh, not really that big of a deal. We are doing decently enough. Mm -hmm. Aha! And we're back down to the ground floor. Alright, so I guess I can start focusing on... The Tetris is again. Whoa! whoa, whoa. I, was, I, I started, I started flipping around the next piece over, and I was like, "Whoa, way too early!" I'm still on, still on the old piece. <laughs> it's okay. As long as it didn't mess me up anyway. There we go. Oh man! Oh man! What? We're at maximum attacking capacity. <laughs> This could be the win! I don't know, we're gonna see. Because there are a lot of good players out there. <laughs> Let's just kind of combo our way out of here. There we go. As long as I get a couple of those combos in there, maybe I can 
put enough pressure on them to perhaps get them into some sort of bad scenario? I don't know. I just noticed that there are a lot of attacks coming a lot quicker now. <laughs> There we go, put that there, oh man, oh man, <laughs> wait, I'm gonna swap that to here, yeah, actually, I'm gonna go put that straight down, slide that in there, pop that there, no, wait, 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 yeah, I'll do, uh-huh, yup, yup, and then we're gonna go put those over, oh, wait, wait, no, 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 don't you dare misdrop at this point in the game, <laughs> Someone did a needle to the spino. Whoa, 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 no, no, I want to, there we go. I was going to say, I don't want to plop that at some sort of weird position. Wait, I'm going to put that there. Now I can put this here for a double. Oh, man. Oh, man. No! <laughs> so close. Well, maybe not that close, because you see that person is, uh, Pretty, pretty cleared out over there, but I did have them about halfway through, if you didn't see that, like up to the top of the screen. So, woo! Closest game yet. <laughs> Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.